Hi everyone! Hey everyone! So in this video, I'm going to be talking about my favorite Kylie Jenner lip kits. So I've got three of them, Mary Jo K, OCK and Coat K. So let me start talking about the packaging. This is the carton that it comes in. It has this uh, Kylie lips with lip color dripping all over. And when you flip it, you can actually see the ingredients and the directions of the products. Yeah, the entire packaging looks very cute. And once you open it, you can actually you can also see the color here. This is the exact color of the lip shade. Once you open it, you get the products like this. So this is uh, Posi lip kit. So this is how the product looks. It comes in this glass uh, lipstick, a uh, lip gloss tube. And the wand is just a sponge applicator. And you can see the lipstick dripping all over. It has the Kylie signature. I really like the packaging. It looks nice. It looks nice and sturdy. And this is the lip liner. Again, this needs to be sharpened. That's the only disadvantage that I found with this lip liner. Now, when I talk about the shade detail, I will explain how I like the shade and how it looks on me and all that. About the packaging, these uh, these comes in a glass tube. I think this is glass. It's quite sturdy, and the applicator is quite nice as well. It really helps apply the product even, and uh, one can just uh, dip in to get the product and scrape out the excess and apply it very nicely. And you can just pop it in your handbag. You can carry it anywhere as you like. The one disadvantage that I noticed with the lip liner is that it's not retractable. You have to sharpen it. So we saw all about the packaging, now about the price, this retails for $29.99 and you guys have to keep a close eye on Kylie's uh, Instagram and other social media accounts where she announced the restock dates. These sell out pretty quickly so one has to be really quick in ordering them. For me, I got it from my friend Katki. So she ordered it for me and it got delivered to her within 7 days of ordering and that is really good. Now moving on to the actual review of these lip kits. Now talking about the texture, this applies very creamy and within 15 seconds of application they settle onto a matte finish which I really really love and I can say that this is 100% transfer proof, it doesn't move, it doesn't bleed, it doesn't feather on your lips which is awesome. Having talked about the texture, I would also like to get into your attention about the dryness of this lipstick. So it is common with every matte lip formula that it tends to dry out your lips a little bit but I didn't feel any sort of dryness by applying this. So before applying I had applied a hydrating lip balm and uh, it goes on, it, it went on very smoothly and it was very comfortable on my lips. I didn't find it to be you know extremely drying or something like that but if you have extremely dry lips you need to make sure that you exfoliate your lips prior to applying this and also apply a very very hydrating lip balm underneath. Now let's move on to the swatches. So I'm going to swatch all three shades right now. So the first shade I'm going to swatch is uh, Posi K. This is my favorite shade. It's, it's a very nice pretty pink nude shade. See how creamy it is. Mm, and it has this really nice caramel or vanilla sort of a fragrance which is actually quite nice. And this is the lip liner that comes with it. Guys, one thing which I have noticed about lip liners is that, especially the MAC lip liners is that, it is quite drying on your lips, but this applies very, very creamy and it doesn't, you know, kind of dry out your lips or don't give you that dry sort of an application. It's very nice. And I really love how the lip color actually matches to that of the lip liner. See how pretty that is. Moving on to the next shade, this is called Mary Jo K. This is one of my favorite lip color from this range. I am a big fan of red matte lipsticks. You guys know that well. So this is a perfect red for every red lip lover. So this is how the color looks. It's such a gorgeous red. And this is the lip liner that comes with it. Again, it applies very very creamy. 
it goes on very very smooth and look at the color you can build the intensity upon your desire how much of intensity you want you can build up the color and it feels very very light unlike posing cake one thing which i noticed about mary jo cake is that the formula is quite runny but once you apply it on your lips it doesn't move it doesn't you know feather on your lips or it doesn't bleed on your lips once it sets into that matte formula it stays on and it's 100% transfer proof which i absolutely love so that was mary jo cake moving on to my another favorite shade gold cake again this is a dark vampy shade it's similar to australis budapest shade if you know how that shade is see how dark and vampy that shade is perfect for a halloween tutorial or perfect for that you know girls my dog and all that this is the lip liner that comes with it again it is the same shade lip liner goes on very very creamy and it doesn't you know dry out your lips or it doesn't give that dry sort of a feel to it which i absolutely adore so these are the swatches in order from left it is posey k and the lip liner that comes with it mary jo k and the lip liner and coat k i absolutely adore all of the swatches and i'm really loving the formula summarizing the review of kylie matte lipsticks so all the three shades goes on very smoothly onto your lips and they doesn't accentuate any fine lines on your lips or doesn't accentuate any dry patches on your lips which is really really nice and the formula is very creamy for posey k and gold k for mary jo k the formula is quite a bit on the runny side but once it is on your lips within 15 seconds it settles onto a matte finish which is really nice and the fact that it is 100% transfer proof makes it even more special yeah so that was the swatches comment which is your favorite shade and why now moving on to lip swatches it's the gala time guys stay tuned so this is my bare lips i'm going to try each of the shades the first shade i'm trying is posey k along with the lip liner that came with it see it applies very very creamy and very very smoothly it's not like the other lip liners which is quite drying and difficult to blend as you can see i'm able to blend it very very easily which is awesome <laughs> So this is how the shade posey looks on me. dried up dried out very very quick that i was able to put a second coat very quickly and it didn't feel heavy or something like that and the formula feels very comfortable on the lips see so if you are planning on a date or you know if you are out with your friends you don't have to worry about the lipstick being transferred to the teacups or something like that so thumbs up for them so watching is uh, mary jo k one of my favorite shade from this range it is the darkest shade this is how the shade looks on me shade is and this has to be my favorite shade from this range absolutely loving it now i 
about the lasting power of these. These pretty much stay the entire day, almost 7 to 8 hours on my lips without drying or any sort of uh, uneasiness like that. And I really like how comfortable it is on my lips. I wore a hydrating lip balm underneath and I exfoliated my lips prior to applying this Kylie lip kits. So I really love how it stayed on, in, on my lips. And uh, one other thing which I need to tell is about how to remove this Kylie lip kits. So I used a normal makeup remover wipes. You can either mix with your uh, mix the makeup remover wipes with your cleansing oil and use it on your lips to remove it, or you can use any other makeup remover also to remove it. As it is transfer proof, I found it pretty much difficult to remove it using the makeup remover wipes alone. I mixed it with my cleansing oil and then I removed it. So that's all about the review of Kylie Cosmetics lip kits. I really love all three shades which I have and I'm looking forward to buy more shades from them. There is a restock which is happening on August 2nd, LA time. So I'm planning to buy the mini lip kits which she is launching. And once I get it, I will be reviewing all of those shades for you guys. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me know in comments which is your favorite shade among the three which I tried today. And do you own any of the Kylie lip kits? Let me know which is your favorite shade. If you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe and share it with your friends. I would like to hear all your feedbacks. And I look forward to reading all of them. Bye guys. Have a great day.